I was always interested in science as a young kid and becoming a doctor really was a passion I think derived from my father. My father was a physician and I got to see what he did. He took me on rounds in the hospital and I really enjoyed you know, really the medical and science part of it. As I progressed in high school and college, I really wanted to understand more about the human body and how it works, and that was one of the reasons why in college I, pursu I pursued a degree in biomedical engineering, because it really encompassed the whole you know, human understanding of science, technology, and medicine together, and that's really what I liked the most about that degree in college, is it combined both you know, medicine and engineering, which I like. So, I pursued that in, in college and then subsequently went on to medicine. While I was in college, I went to Tulane University and I studied biomedical engineering there. And I was really interested mostly in orthopedic surgery. As a biomedical engineer, I wanted to integrate engineering and medicine together and develop, develop artificial parts, or artificial organs, or find new set solutions to medical problems. It wasn't until really my fourth year of medical school where I found and developed an interest and a passion for dermatology. I actually had the chance to rotate during medicine with a wonderful female uh, dermatologist and she really showed me what was available in this specialty. And I really didn't realize the extent of surgical procedures and the extent of medicine. I was always a person during my medical school year training that liked surgery and medicine and dermatology gave me the option to combine both. I also liked the ability to interact with adults, kids, um, males and females and it was a specialty that really was all encompassing both from a medical and a surgical aspect and that's really what enticed me the most into dermatology. Hair transplantation is a very unique field and as a dermatologist, dermatologist is the only board certified specialty that studies true hair disorders and the treatment of hair disorders and finding solutions for hair problems. So as dermatologists we are skin, hair and nail experts. And it was during my residency in dermatology at KU Medical Center where I came across other physicians that were doing hair transplantation surgery and I got a chance to work with them, learn about the procedures and since I was very surgically oriented it really drew me towards that procedure and it was something I desired to pursue.